Cyber attacks are constantly increasing in sophistication and severity, and organizations are typically responding by increasing the number of security tools within their arsenal to combat such threats. As their security stack grows, it results in too many interfaces to navigate across and a security solution that is too complex to utilize effectively. In this scenario, when a tool identifies a threat, you'll need to jump to a whole other interface to augment the investigation with additional intelligence. With the CrowdStrike Falcon platform, it solves the problem by being able to enrich existing data with additional threat intelligence from outside vendors, all within the Falcon user interface, and simplifies the security workflow. This provides a unified console experience that enhances existing Falcon data based on the context of the security artifact and will significantly reduce the time spent triaging and remediating alerts. Now, let's take a look to see how easy it is to enable a new integration and the capabilities that are available after we've completed the initial setup. We'll start at the CrowdStrike store. Here, we'll use the category filter and select Context Enrichment and click Apply. This will list all the applications that provide context enrichment. When we click on an app, such as Six Skills Dark Feed, it will provide an overview and any links to additional assets, such as a demo video. Looking at Dark Feed's description, we can see that it provides visibility and context of IOCs from the deep and dark web and is powered by Six Skills Data Lake of Underground Threat Intelligence. We can try the app for free or activate an existing subscription by clicking on the Try It Free button. It allows us to bring our own API credentials if we're already a customer, or we can request a trial by clicking on the I don't have an API credentials box and clicking on the Agree and Request Trial button. After the initial setup, it will say Active or Trial in Progress, depending on the current status. At the end of the trial, there will be an email with additional information on how to continue to use the application. Now that the setup is complete, we'll have access to the information from the integrated vendors directly within the Falcon console. One method of viewing the enriched intelligence data is to use the global search at the top of the page. The global search can search through many aspects of the Falcon platform, such as actors, detections, documentation, and incidents. We can also search directly for LCs, such as file hashes, IP addresses, or domains. Let's say that we received a file hash through a threat feed and we wanted to find more details on the file. We can paste the file hash directly into the global search box and hit enter. This will bring up the result card for the hash and we can see the information from CrowdStrike's intelligence. We can also see the tabs of any context enrichment apps for this type of IOC that we have enabled in our Falcon platform. We can just click on a tab and it will show us the curated data from that app. Here we can see the intelligence information provided by OpSWAT. The intelligence data presented depends on the application, but we can see that OpSWAT has the information such as a Metascan score and a history timeline. This diversified scanning engine can provide additional context to the nature of the threat. We can also use the See More at OpSWAT link to pivot directly to OpSWAT's site, which will provide us with additional data directly from their site. Alright, the global search works great if we wanted information on a specific IOC, but what about if we find a detection in the workflow? CrowdStrike is also able to seamlessly provide context on artifacts identified within incidents. Incidents are a list of alerts driven by its crowd score, which combines disparate security detections into a single alert. This allows us to prioritize critical incidents and reduce noise of inconsequential detections. When we click on an incident, it will provide a summary preview of the incident. This gives us an overview at a quick glance. We'll click on the See Full Incident button for additional lenses with which we can view the incident. Let's click on the Table View. I do want to quickly mention that even though we'll be just looking at the Table View, the cards with the context enrichment are also available in the Graph and Event Timeline view as well. In the legend, let's expand the DNS request. This will show all the DNS requests made by the processes within this incident. When we click on PowerShell.exe, this will bring us to a process in the process trace, as well as open a tab for the process at the bottom. Here, it will show us additional information on the detection, but if we scroll to the DNS requests section, we can see all the DNS requests that were made by this process. We can click on the domain to bring up its card. On the card, it will start us off on the CrowdStrike's activity tab, which will show us its detection within the environment. We can also take a look at CrowdStrike's intelligence tab. That will show us intelligence information provided by the Falcon platform. Also on the card are tabs for the other vendors that can enrich our content. 
Now, we'll just click on Domain Tools to see the enhanced domain intelligence data that is provided by them. Alongside Falcon Intelligence data, Domain Tools has over 30 years of intelligence experience with domain registries. It looks like they have rated the domain with an overall risk score of 100, which is extremely high. Domain Tools also breaks out phishing, malware, and spam scores into individual components, providing us with additional context. As we can see, CrowdStrike Falcon with context enrichment enables security teams to reduce the time necessary for triaging and remediating incidents. The seamless integration simplifies the workflow by bringing in rich data from other vendors directly into the Falcon console user interface, allowing for rapid investigation of sophisticated incidents without having to jump through multiple security tools.